congratulate him. Welcome, Wesley, and a big congratulations. Hi, hi, uh, Peter. Hi, Tanya. Please tell us, for uh, first of all, just about your feeling when you had this final blitz game and you had this position. What were your thoughts? Were you very upset with yourself giving Magnus this chance of bouncing back? Yeah, yeah, exactly. I, I was already uh, regretting my opening choice. Yeah, I, I, I thought I was gonna lose. I was gonna lose this game straightforwardly because I missed this bishop takes b5. Yeah, it's a very strong move. Bishop takes a takes. Yeah, b, bishop d6 was a mistake. Yeah, here it's just bad for black. Knight a7. Yeah, I think this should be technical loss. Very rare to have so many decisive games when you were going through it. Uh, can you share your thoughts? Were you feeling just how combative and aggressive this match was turning out to be? Yeah, I feel like uh, I have. I feel like uh, um, I wanted eight decisive games in the end. <laughs> So I was going for complicated positions and stuff, but uh, but yeah, I feel Magnus allowed me to come back uh, so many times in this match. I feel like, of course, he's a bear player, so he had so many so many chances to to finish this match already yesterday and today. No, this is incredible analysis to get all your thoughts on these uh, very critical moments. Uh, uh, Wesley, give us an idea that when you were going into the playoffs, how were you were you thinking about your chances? How were you assessing the general situation of of the playoffs? Uh, the general position play. Well, I stand by what I said yesterday. I felt like uh, in a blitz game with only two games, anything can happen. Mm -hmm. So, uh, so yeah, I didn't mind going for for the blitz at all. Throughout the event, we really felt that you were. You were in very good shape. At least that's how we were talking about it a lot, and it kept coming up that you were really on on your, um, uh, you know, like showing incredible chess in this format. While playing, did you also feel that yes, you are you are doing well, and you're you're creating these beautiful games? Did you feel good about not just the joy of winning, but also the quality of your play? Yeah, I felt very happy with my match with Magnus uh, because I felt like I was putting pressure on games where I shouldn't and uh i'm finding moves which i shouldn't and he's make and he's giving me chances which should never happen yeah because he's a much better player but yeah it's very very surprising because uh um i guess it helps the fact that i had nothing left to lose after trail after trailing my match with Tamor rajabob in the quarterfinals I basically expected my tournament to end there. So anything more than that is just an added bonus. And uh, maybe that also helped when you play fearless attacking chess. You don't care if you lose. Just try to play good moves. Right. Um, yeah, maybe that 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 plays part. But it turned out that uh, my quarterfinals match with Roger Bob turned out to be the most critical because uh, I... Uh, he, yeah. should, he, he probably should have won that match too. That was a really big comeback win, uh, Wesley. And I was my next question was going to be that you know it's uh, this nine day format with different uh, different formats, different opponents. Which was the most challenging for you? I think the preliminaries you went through, but out of the quarters, semis, and finals, you faced Rajabov, then you faced Hikaru, then you faced Magnus. Uh, which was would you say the Rajabov match was the most challenging? Uh, no, definitely the the Magnus match. I mean, I don't think you can say that uh, that the that anyone's match is easier than facing Magnus, yeah, because he's mm. the best player. So I, I still think my toughest match is Magnus because again, he allowed me so many unnecessary comebacks uh, yesterday and today. Uh, he could have went for safe draws in the last game yesterday, also the second game today, and that would practically uh seal seal the victory for him so i felt he gave me too many chances to to bounce back but uh, but definitely my match with Raja Bob, i was i was on the ropes there yeah. uh he had so, he had so many chances to put me out of that match also and in uh, the way Raja Bob played on our on the first day of our quarterfinals was just uh incredible yeah but that being said uh yeah, today has been interesting. Just the last question, Wesley. You won so you know you you're the winner of 
so many events. You won the St. Louis Rapid and Blitz joint winner with um, uh, with Magnus. So where does this winning the first the first tournament of the of this new tour where does it figure in your list of uh, list of achievements? How important was this event for you? Uh, yes, yeah, yeah, good question. Yeah, it's very high. I probably rated as uh, uh, this year as my second most important win behind the U.S. Championship because U.S. Championship is really prestigious for any player. But yeah, I'd rate it there. But uh, today there was there was a lot of stake. First of all, fifteen thousand difference, and mm-hmm. second the title, and also finally, most importantly, uh, it enables it allows me to qualify right away for the finals. 